On November 13th, NASA announced finding significant amounts of water on the moon. When the spent Centaur rocket traveling with the Lunar Crater Observation and Sensing Satellite, or LCROSS, struck the moon on October 9th, it sent up a plume of moon dust. Minutes later, the LCROSS satellite flew through this plume, conducting ultraviolet and infrared spectrometer analyses. A spectrometer examines light emitted or absorbed by materials which, in turn, helps identify their composition. The LCROSS analyses showed that the spectra in the lunar dust match the spectra for water. And it turns out the sample contained at least 26 gallons of water in the form of ice formed over billions of years. Jackpot. Scientists targeted the South Pole Crater Impact Site because of its temperature, minus 365 degrees Fahrenheit, quite literally, where the sun don't shine. In these craters, water can freeze and collect over billions of years. So where did the water come from originally? Within the moon? Comets? Solar winds? Scientists are hoping that eventually they'll find the answer to this. In the meanwhile, they are considering what this amazing find might mean to our space program. A lunar space station, perhaps? Only time will tell.